Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Indiana Gear Up YouTube channel. We're so excited that you joined us today. As Indiana Gear Up works to build capacity and resources and to be of support to our schools, teachers, parents, students, and community partners, we first want to let you know of ways in which we can connect. As you're joining us today on our YouTube channel at Indiana Gear Up, please subscribe to our page, share with your friends, family, any community members that may be interested in learning more about the resources or projects that we're working on uh, throughout the remainder of the year into the summer, professional development that we have, as well as preparing for next year. Uh, you can find us on social media platforms such as Facebook at Indiana Gear Up, Twitter at Indiana Gear Up, as well as Instagram at Indiana Gear Up. Also, you can reach out to us via email, indianagearup at purdue.edu. We have staff members behind the scenes who are readily available to answer any questions that you may have. Um, today, we'll be looking at how you connect with us on our website at indianagearup.org. And more specifically, our resource tab that's available for teachers right now. Um, we have an Indiana Gear Up COVID-19 resource folder that's available and it's free. This was developed um, by a seasoned expert of team, uh, a team of regional directors um, who have really just have an ample amount of experience in the education field. Uh, there are several documents here um, that you can browse through and use at your leisure. Um, today, more specifically, we're gonna be taking a look at the Gear Up Educational website resources. And each day we're going to be sharing a tutorial on one of these websites that is specific to the subject for the high school level, the link that is available, the description, as well as the services that are currently offered. Again, we hope that, that this can be of use to you now or in the near future for teachers, uh, staff members, parents, um, or community members. So enjoy. All right, we'll go ahead and dive into our first educational website in which we're going to share today. Um, as you can see, it is 12 virtual museums throughout the world. If you go ahead and click on that link, it is gonna direct you to 12 historical museums um, that are famous throughout the world. And what's interesting about this website is it gives the direct link below to each one, 12 that are listed here centrally. Some of the advertisements are a little busy. Um, however, you can direct students, um, let's say to British Museum of London, the virtual tour, that link is gonna be here. You can embed it into lessons um, that will help them navigate directly there. So what's interesting about the Museum of Worlds that is uh, British London, if this is second to load. So what's cool about this website is it has uh, thousands of artifacts that are listed here broken down by a timeline and these artifacts are by culture and art and it really gives the historical um, timeline of events uh, broken down that is famous throughout the world. Uh, as you can see there are various countries here and what's really cool about it is once you click on the artifact it shows you the link and impact of which it the countries as well as futuristically. So we'll just do the Bowl of Roses, I believe this one is, yes. Um, and if we go to find out more, what's really cool is that it gives you the facts about this particular item, as well as a audio, the origin in which it was from, and related objects. So if we go ahead and play the audio and just listen a little bit more about it, students can um, write down or pull facts out in which they thought were really cool from this. Maybe they can select 10 and report back to you or just write a small summary on each one of these artifacts and then submit it as a um, assignment. So that just gives you a little bit insight of what you can expect from each one of the artifacts as you select them. And really hope we, we hope that you can use this um, as a tool for students to see the world from your classroom or from their home. So we hope you can use it here in the near future. And that's all we have for today. You guys take care.